A day at the beach turns violent when a Bonita Springs woman says her poodle is viciously attacked by another dog. And she wants to make sure this doesn't happen to anyone else. Foreign Recorder's Julia Salamone live tonight to explain what you should do if your pet is attacked in public. Julie? Emily, this lady says that her dog was bit in seven different places by a pit bull. And tonight she wants to warn other pet owners to make sure the same thing doesn't happen again. In the first day, he just lay there. Donna Ingram says she's glad to see her dog Braxton on all fours again. He was punctured seven different spots, and the blood started oozing, so I knew it may be imperative I get him to the vet. Donna took these pictures of her poodle's white coat turned red. And he got severely bit here and here. She says a dog attacked her five-year-old poodle on Sunday at a Lee County dog beach at the south end of Lover's Key. Donna says her poodle had just got out of the water when a pit bull ran up and bit her dog in the leg. She says the owner of the pit bull just took off. If my pet had done that to somebody, I would not have fled the scene. Now she wants to warn other pet owners to be on the lookout. If you have an aggressive dog, take the precautions. I took Donna's concerns to Lee County Parks and Recs. I'm told Lee County isn't responsible for injuries. Owners are responsible for their dogs. <laughs> this video we shot tonight at the dog park is perfect proof owners need to be in control at all times. So how do you know if an animal might attack? His mouth might be open, um, like he's a little, getting a little bit um, overzealous. you got to watch your dog's um, body language. Your dog's going to tell you when something's about to happen. Donna's main concern is a smaller dog <laughs> might not have shaken off an attack as easily. If it was a Chihuahua Shih Tzu, that dog would have had no chance. And this dog beach already has a number of rules in place to help keep your animals safe out there. I'm told that aggressive dogs are not allowed anywhere near the beach. And if your pet does get bit, you are asked to contact Animal Services for a complete, for a complete list of the dog beach rules and how to keep your animals safe. Just log on to foxfornow.com. Live in Collier County tonight, Julie Salmon, Fox 4, in your corner. All right, thank you, Julie. What do you think about this? Voice your view on fox4now.com or call us at 239-206-FOX4.